one little niche I have that uh, just happens to be something I love to do. It fits with respect to everything I offer, having uh, the, the whole basic of personal growth and development of becoming your full potential. And that is, is career coaching. I just enjoy it. I've been fortunate. I've really worked within the talent acquisition environment. I teach recruiting here at the University of California at San Diego. I come to know the game. And what I really love to do is, is to help people, particularly in transition that have been, you know, outsourced, laid off from a job to really be able to get back on the saddle, so to speak, and be able to find their way in this real challenging landscape to finding a job today. And it's uh, fun, I really enjoy it. And it's, it's something that uh, with that knack, been fortunate to be really helpful in terms of getting people to go out and land. Now, your comment also alludes to a real second thing, which is beginning to prepare the younger generations for growth. Well, what's great today is, is they brought in, they've gifted us with a different mindset towards careers today. And they really, that's why you see today an average of 2.8 years in a job for the 25 to 39 years old, wow. right? because they've learned how to make it work in this ever-changing landscape of jobs, right? With growing competition, global competition, finances, economies, so on and so forth. Companies come and go. What were the big Fortune 500 companies are mere memories, you know, right. here today, right? And the new ones are growing and emerging as we speak here. And so it's really a matter of really being able to blend you know, the new with the old in terms of here's the new way, but what is it that you do? And it's this whole concept of continuous development, of learning what's next and having this vision of career. To me, the, re the beauty of what career coaching can be is when you coincide it with life coaching, because really what you ideally want is a career that's lined up with what you want in life and who you are, right? If you can marry those, imagine the fun, the joy, the meaning, the sense of purpose that you can have in your work environment. For too many people, we've accepted, I need a job to get money, to pay my bills, so on and so forth. But what if we were able to find a way to combine? It may not happen overnight, but if we take the strides to start thinking about what is the gifts that we can do, that we already have, and what can we develop that could really allow us to better pursue this kind of environment, a job. And I just land, I worked with one gentleman uh, who came out as a vice president in a company, said, I'm tired of that. I really want something different, mm -hmm. but I'm really good at running a business. And so he really developed his uh, understanding and some of the skills to be able to work in a non-for-profit. And today he's at a very senior level in a major non-for-profit here today and loving every day of his work and career because he finally married together who he was as a person, as a human being, with the opportunity to help others, bringing in gifts of being able to run a business and help a non-for-profit run a business. That's the kind of concepts that are emerging today. So as if we can begin to start preparing our youth today to start thinking about a vision for them, who they really want to be or begin that discovery process so they can help to begin finding where the potential is, where that might fit in these ever-growing landscape of challenges to be. Hi there. Thanks for viewing the video. Be sure to check out my website, www.growhumanpotential.com for a lot more information on the topics of personal growth and self-discovery. There you'll find information on my book, on personal growth, self-discovery, ebook on leadership, coaching, which I provide both career coaching and life coaching, access to my blog, etc. Most importantly, I hope to have provided you with some information to help you on your own journey to discover you. Have a great day. Thank you.